Capricorn, welcome back to Majestic Notion, guys. Welcome to your or the rest of October reading. Okay, Capricorn, these are general, of course. They won't resonate for every Capricorn out there. It's for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Jupiter placements. So if it doesn't resonate with you today, look at another placement in your chart. All right. Um, this is you versus them. So your energy, for the sake of the reading, will be on this side for the Watcher. And your person will be on this side. Now, it can resonate the other way around. Use your discernment as it will resonate different for everyone. And then we're going to get into mutual energies in the middle here between you and your person. If there are any external energies that I pick up on intuitively or I see for either side or both, we will, use, we will go through the external energies outside of you and them. Or the connection itself and then we'll get into the outcome between you as it stands whether it's an emotional outcome an action or you know or a mutual feeling here um, so thank you guys so much for your likes your shares your subscriptions all your beautiful wonderful comments thank you so much you know I try to watch or at least look at all of them but I can't because there's so many, but I thank you anyways. I do appreciate them. Please hit that like button, Capricorn. Subscribe to that channel here. And hit the notification bell for those of you who would like to know when your readings pop up. And share, share, share. And let's get into it, guys. I tell you what, man. There's been a lot of revelations happening in the tarot world. A lot of epiphanies, a lot of breakthroughs, and it's not just for the tarot world because it's the people that are actually going through these situations that are uh, finding out a lot of hidden truths, okay? It's been popping out a lot. So prepare to be shocked in the month of October by the things you find out, okay? So let's get into the Amira's Love Oracle. And uh, you might have a little shock of your own here. Who knows? This is going to be mutual energies between you and your person. Keep in mind that your person could be a crush, someone coming into your life, someone you're with, someone from your past. Could be a friend, family, co-worker. All right. One more shuffle. All right. Mutually, what is happening for Capricorn and their person spirit? Alright, Twin Flame off the bat, Capricorn, alright, I'm hearing together at last, strong at last, that's what I'm hearing, but we have Dating Queen at the bottom, so I feel like who is it, you're getting offers, but who is the Twin Flame, do you know, or is it a surprise? Yeah, we got travel. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I think you got a few contenders. I'm not going to lie. Somebody wants an open relationship with you. Um, there are people that want to ask you out, but some of them had have weird intentions. Okay, some of some of them definitely see you're gifted. You could be a brunette for some of you, or a redhead, or blonde. Somebody here has light eyes. Okay, so let's see. Let's get a shaman stream oracle. So you both could be dating at this time, or you're both single, is what I'm seeing. So let's see. Let's see how this transpires here, Capricorn. One more shuffle for mutual energies for Capricorn and their person. Okay, gathering around the power of community. Number 26. Adding up to eight. That's the infinity symbol. The power of community. So you guys are surrounded by other people here. 
or you're meeting at some type of gathering. You know, this kind of looked like some kind of red carpet or some kind of event. It doesn't have to be the red carpet event, but I don't know. You might get invited to something for some of you where your twin flame is going to be. Or maybe that's your twin flame inviting you. I don't know. What's going on here? Bottom of the deck. Yeah, sacred contract with the divine number. Obviously, twin flames do have a contract. We had the fortune's wheel, luck and right timing. Okay, something's coming together quite quickly here. Number 23 could be significant here, but there is change here. Five. And we have new beginnings here with one. And we have tidy house, clarity, and organization. Honey, I feel like somebody's coming. Spirit's like, you gotta get ready. Somebody could be in the entertainment industry, or they're just very creative, art artist type of energy. Both of you could be this way, number 33. You guys know how I feel about that number. Somebody could have um, had a Kundalini rising, but also I'm seeing two people that things come to you because of the energy. You guys know how to manifest, as often Twin Flames do. Confidence in your magic. Yeah, have confidence in this magic, because this is there. So let's get a fortune for you, too. All right, let's see what else is happening mutually here. Now, you both could be attending a gathering together or separate from each other. Maybe that's where all these other prospects come in, these contenders. One more shuffle here. Let's see what's happening here going on Capricorn mutual energy let's see eagle you will soar towards your destiny with greater clarity and strength you will soar towards your destiny somebody's coming they, and again I see the plane there's some travel involved here somebody's coming they see it for what it is, that's for sure. Somebody might have went through a major change in their life and now they're starting to see things. Yeah, love surrounds all your connections. Move forward positively in all areas of your life. So there is a level of friendships around both of you that will be all for this connection. Alright? It's what I'm feeling. I feel like somebody's being... Um... not push towards you but like being influenced to go your way okay so let's take a look at your person's energy and then we'll come back to the mutual energies between you after going through yours as well I'm going to use my intergalactic tarot plus oracle we're gonna get into your person's energy here all decks that I use of course will be below the video in the description box Two more shuffles, two more shuffles. Let's see what's happening with your person. Somebody could be going public that they're single. going on spirit Capricorn's person of course you guys often astral travel with twin flames being here so we have astral projection travel and visitations again an indication of travel somebody does want to come see you what I'm picking up or somebody could just be your twin flame could be traveling at this time yeah <laughs> astral travel indeed dreams insight revelations prophecies and visions Okay, whoever this twin is, they are aware of the connection. They know you exist. Okay, right? you are connecting on a higher realm. And then there's a level of something in the matrix. Okay, the matrix oppression, limited beliefs, cannot see past the veil and entrapment. Um, what I'm seeing here, there's something about this person's three-dimensional world here. Let's see here. Okay, enchantress, alluring, mystical, and charming. So 
You know what I just heard? You're out of this world. You're out of this world. This is on a higher realm, not not the three-dimensional space. That's what twin flames are about. Okay, you man, you're, you're already ex coexist in the spiritual realm. It's a matter of it manifesting in your reality. Um, but they're out of this world as well. But I feel like they think about you in this way. You you could be coming into their dreams, is what I'm seeing. And they find you to be out of their world. But this could be the person you're connecting to. Is um, they're they're alluring, okay? They're very charming, male or female. Judgment. Nine of Cups. You know, I feel like. Your person held back because they were so into this, a specific way of looking at things, right? A limited mindset, which then didn't let them see outside of their traditions or conditioning, how they were brought up, you know. And because you're out of this world, you are, you are a wish fulfillment, but I feel like they judged you when they couldn't see. You know, they still had the blindfolds on, okay? But they see you are wish fulfillment. Um, also, they could have dealt with, you know, been dealing with some type of karma here. Yeah. Manipulator, trickster, and liar. What is going on here? So the person you were dealing with, hmm, I feel like they, what is this? If you're dealing with a feminine here, your person is a feminine, I feel like they're definitely an individual. And even if they, like your twin flame, they weren't awakened before, they are. They got out of this mentality, you know, that of the mundane and just the three-dimensional aspects. They're flying high here. But there might be someone that you met in your past here or this person your person that wants wish fulfillment they want to come back around because they they are very attracted to this energy okay so I'm almost feeling like maybe you're watching to see what the divine feminine is up to or divine masculine take it how it resonates but there's someone around them that wants some sort of wish fulfillment with them is what I'm picking up here we're gonna so we're gonna get into external energies because I am seeing this here. Let's get one more. Page of Pentacles. This is scrub energy, but also manipulative. This is someone that breadcrumbs. This is a ghoster. Okay. This is someone that gaslights. They're trying to come back around with with this charm here because they want the wish fulfillment. So they dream about this person. Okay. Let's take a look at what your energy looks like. But let's, let me look at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, Ten of Swords, Seven of Swords, Ace of Swords with the Wheel of Fortune and a Knight of One. Somebody wants to come back around. They're a headache. Okay. They caused a lot of... Um, heaviness a lot of heartache and a lot of this person is a burden basically and they're relentless wheel of fortune with judgment is somebody that wants to come back around and they plan to take a stab at it with the knight of wands and the seven of swords wanting to yet again stab this person some more so however you want to see it betray this person once again they want to sleep with this person So I feel like your person's energy is this, the enchantress, right? But this person is still connecting on a dream state, but they want to make this sex a reality. Okay, that's what I'm getting here. 
So you could be a masculine watching. Let's get into your energy. Capricorn. And a wands again with the Page of Pentacles. One's a burden. It's like they want, they're codependent too, is what I'm feeling. And you're the Empress? I just saw the Empress there with the Seven of Cups. You got options. Oh, where, where? And I just saw the Six of Cups. Yeah, you're the Empress and you got options. Or your person is the Empress. Now, it could be that your person is here, right? They're the manipulator, and all they think about and dream about is you. And you're the watcher, so we're going to see. The Empress could be the watcher here. One more shuffle. So this person has a limited mindset. can't see past their conditioning temperance yeah I feel like this is the Empress ah so somebody wants to lie and manipulate yeah six of cups the past came out again the Empress you are a divine feminine most definitely okay and you're an earth angel with the temperance and the divine feminine here. Self-love. Okay. And ace of cups here. So that's what this is. You are dealing with somebody from your past that is a manipulator. Okay. They want wish fulfillment. What I'm what I don't like, because we had Dating Queen, and I said, Who is the gun who is the twin flame here? Remember? This is not it. This is not your twin flame, this manipulator. But there could have been karma here with judgment with this person. Because you're soaring above the trees. You're going to see your twin, your real twin for what it is. We have the Ace of Cups. It's also self-worth, self-love. Okay. Equilibrium, balance. Yeah. Taking care of yourself, independence, Queen of Pentacles energy. Love it. Yeah, getting plenty of beauty, rest, and healing. Four of Swords. Reflection. Self-reflection. I see a lot here. Yeah. You're looking for something more balanced when it comes to love. Because you are balanced with Temperance and the Six of Pentacles. And Empress here. One more card. Knight of Swords. Yeah, I'm telling you, somebody from your past hmm, wants to come back. Yeah, somebody's coming after you because you're 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 headed towards a new beginning here. Okay, somebody's buying a new car here, but you're headed towards a new beginning. Ace of Pentacles and the Chariot. You successfully walked away from this person, but they can't. Yeah, we have the world here with the four of with the four of cups in the world. They missed this opportunity. You're gone. Okay, you're the gift. You're the prize. You are gone. I feel you're going to be living your best life if you're not already. Okay, we got a nice car with the with the queen of uh, the queen, the uh, empress here. I mean, shit. Yeah, they're left out in the cold, so they feel some type of way. They feel rejected. Ain't that some shit? And they're the manipulator. Oh my goodness. What? Yeah. You turn ice cold, you cut that shit out, and you healed. This person knows, oh my god, this person knows you have options, by the way. With the Six of Wands, Five of Wands, and the Knight of Wands, they want to come here. 
but you're like, nope, you're blocking these options. See, dating queen. There's a lot of people that want to date you. You know who your twin flame is. Ace of swords with the lovers in the sun. So you don't want any of these options. You're like, nope, no thanks. So you got... <laughs> Damn. You got people wanting to... The thing is that all these people want to sleep with you. Knight of Wands with the Five of Wands. With the Six of Wands. You're at, you're beating them off with a bat. You better back up. <laughs> I know who my twin flame is. That's who I want. But you're looking damn good. Page of Swords, people are watching you. You're confident as fuck, too. You're embodying all the queens, I can tell you that much. That's what the Empress embodies. And yeah, th we got a page here with the Four of Pentacles. Holding back because they know you walked away. Yeah. This person was shocked when you walked away. They thought they were going to um, manipulate you forever. <laughs> Little did they know. Damn. Okay. Let's see what's going on over here, shall we? What is this devious plan this person has? Because they want to come back around. They want this wish fulfillment. They want to sleep with you. You might, you may have not slept with this person. They tried, though. They tried. They sure did. I feel like you got, you got away from somebody that was circling you that was uh, no good. Let's see here. Somebody in your past was uh, significant here. So this could have been somebody you learned a major lesson from. Somebody that hurt you, even if it was just a crush. Maybe didn't treat you right. You know, they're disrespected. Any, anybody that's in the Page of Pentacles with Manipulator, Trickster, Liar. You can't expect anything good from that. So let's see what's going on here. Yep, the Devil and the Nine of Swords. He can't sleep at night, can he? The devil and the nine of swords. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the world. You, you close that cycle successfully. That's why you have the chariot, the ace of pentacles. And you you're, you're have so much self-love. Okay? They can't get over it. They want to apologize, but they're, it, it's not genuine. They hold back because they know you're confident as fuck. They don't even know what you're up to. Yeah, they know. They intuitively feel this is completely done with. Hold on a second. Whew, my throat got itchy there. Yeah, they know this is completely over. Okay, they feel it intuitively. They know it's in their psyche. That's why they hold back. And as they should, because you ain't gonna fall for this bullshit. Okay? Yeah, they know they crumbed you with the Page of Pentacles once again. You're confident. Queen of Wands. you confident in who you are. All right, let's get into this energy first. I want to get into this twin flame energy. What's going on here? Because I feel like this is the new connection. Ace of Cups. Somebody's coming. The power of community. Somebody could be in the public eye here, but let's see. I'm also getting the power of community of twin flames. One more shuffle. Alright, 
what's going on here mutually with this twin flame. The crossroads, of course, that comes out a lot. Judgment. King of Cups. Remember, two of wands. We have two directions here. Okay. Ten of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles. Mutual energies. So what I'm seeing here is both of you had gone your separate ways to deal with karma, which I see here. Okay, but there are mutual feelings here with the King of Cups, and I feel like you guys are supposed to work obviously together with the Ten of Pentacles and the Eight of Pentacles, and you both want to work on this. You are here to build an empire, that's Ten of Pentacles energy. Okay, your ancestors are here, you're here to break generational curses, that's very adamant. And, uh, you know, you both had to split ways. So you both had split ways here with the two of wands is what I'm seeing here because of that. But I feel you're coming together now to work together. Okay, let's look at the bottom here. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles, and which we already saw here. So you're both on the path now to build this empire and work together, okay, with the world here. That's a new cycle okay of pure abundance here um, but material gains as well so I feel like you guys are coming together soon here seven of swords with the wheel of fortune and strength okay so somebody's walking away from a relationship here they were deceived in their healing um, I'm seeing shooting star here with the eight of wands so this is a wish fulfillment. This is faith with the star and the eight of wands, the shooting star. Um, definitely somebody's healing from some type of deception. I see the devil here with the king of wands. Yeah, this is this person hanging around. Yeah, you, you had the strength to walk away, okay? That's what I'm seeing and learning you're also destined to teach with the star and the hierophant here both of you are okay you're connected to a higher power connected to source okay um so let's see what's happening here mutually let's get a little further into that capricorn so tell me about this twin flame yeah two of swords you guys aren't communicating right now but you see the target is what I'm seeing there yeah you both had to split ways to learn lessons so that's what was going on there yeah people outside of this connection will be jealous or have been or you were dealing with people that you know wanted to win at all costs that was a major lesson as well. We have a King of Pentacles here. So your twin flame could be an earth sign. But what I see here with all these pentacles, they could be either wealthy, someone that come in, coming into your life to help you grow even further. But we, with the King and Queen of Pentacles, you guys could create miracles here. With the Ace of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles, you guys will acquire um, a lot of material gain okay there's no doubt about that so people will be jealous of this connection because you guys are going to be it's like you're each other's jackpot it's just endless endless amount of abundance when you guys come together you're going to be working together yeah two of pentacles the hangman and the nine of pentacles so this person, again, they're very independent, so they could have a lot on their plate right now when it comes to work. Yeah, Seven of Cups, they do have a lot on their plate. 
Um, definitely they could have some options here that, okay. Yeah, they're trying to sort out some things here when it comes to work. Okay. What else is happening here between you? Yeah, Queen of Cups. Scorpio Pisces Cancer. I definitely see you have a, love, a lot of compassion, a lot of love in your heart, and you're open to this love. Ace of Pentacles, once again. They do want to make you an offer. I'm, I'm telling you, somebody, Seven of Pentacles, they want to invest. Yeah. <laughs> I feel you came out of the blue for this person. Four of Cups with the Magician. Whoa. And, you know, they do fear this. Okay. They have for a while, but I feel like now they're being guided. And they've always been guided, but they're being... There's people that are jealous, yes. That could have been what created fear. It could have been on both sides. But there's also people that are encouraging this person to move towards you. It's not this person. Okay, that was a lesson. That's the devil. That's not this. This is very abundant right here. So let's see here. Mutual energies between you. Yeah, I see you differently now. Because you guys have grown. Okay, you've been through a lot. Yeah, and you both made mistakes, right? Obviously, you know, they went through theirs as well. But like I say, there's no mistakes. It's just a learning experience. Yeah, they, they got bored. You know, you guys could be bored right now. Not being together, I saw that here as well. Missing each other, you know. Especially if they're if your twin flame is just concentrated at work, they're bored. Yeah, something might have, might have transpired here. What is this? I'm done for now. Yeah, I think they're taking a break here from work, and that's why they're coming to see you. Okay, this is too much, or they were going through a breakup. Okay, because we do have judgment here. Yeah, they got a lot going on, guys. Not now. One of you do. Or it could be the both of you. But I see you are at peace is what I'm seeing. They have a lot of going on. Work-wise and who knows what else. But they know there's still hope. Okay. And uh, you, you make them whole. We are meant for each other. You both know that. And you know this is love true love yeah you make each other happy okay all right Capricorn I think that's what I got for you so forget about this little devil here they're trying to manipulate of course manifest their way back into your life but they hold back because they know you're standing in strong in your confidence you already learned that lesson and your person boy they got a lot going on you were you were somebody else but I feel it's your person I think they have their own business their empire with all those pinnacles there okay they have a lot of work on their plate and they're dealing with some kind of uh, situation here all right but that's being basically washed away from their life with that you know not now this is like the tower okay something is being cleaned out of their their space to make room for this connection Alright guys, that's what I have Capricorn. Let me know in the comments if anybody resonates and I wish you the best. Bye bye.